Hey guys, it's Gaming Mastering here. I'm very sorry, it's been so long since I made my last video. I've just been on holidays. I've been thinking though, I got a cool game we can make today. It's called Runner. So it's a game where, let me just quickly delete that, where there's a fish or whatever you want, and he, every time you answer a question, he gets closer to your target. So let's do that game, shall we? So I'm gonna get a backdrop, and I feel like an ocean vibe today. So I'm gonna go underwater and get number two. I'm also gonna get a sprite and get a fish. Yeah, okay. I have a fish. Also, I want another sprite where the target is so I can go to the target so let me see what I can do hmm. let's get the crystal that's a good look that's a good one the crystal so now let's do some coding shall we for this guy we are going to do when this clicked Go to the coordinates, and that's what we need to do first. Now we want to make it, ask a question, move there, move closer to that. So let's go like this. This is how you make questions. When this clicked, I'm going to wait one second. Wait, nah, two seconds. Wait two seconds ask I'm just gonna quickly do a multiplication one what's two times two let's just say and then we will go to control get an if statement go to operators get the equal one so it'll be if go to sensing answer equals which is the answer four then move 20 steps simple so let's try it wait two seconds and then what's two times two four see and then he moves awesome so let's do that let's duplicate it okay now what we're going to do is we're going to remove that from there and we're going to use something that I haven't showed you yet. We're going to get broadcast message 1 and then what we're going to get is when I receive. So it's sending a message to here so once it's all ended it will send a message to this one and then this will play. So let's go with this one. three times three equals nine so let's try again wait two seconds four enter wait two seconds nine enter and see we're gonna do it all the way to there so let's do this we are going to create a new one and we're going to get another broadcast, but we'll have to change the number. New message. What should this one be? Number two. Okay. When I receive number two. Okay. I'm going to do four times four. Four times four, four, eight, twelve, sixteen. Sixteen. Yep. So let's try again. Two times two is four. Three times three is nine. That's sixteen. And let's keep going. This might take a while, guys, but it's a good game. Especially if you are a teacher or something, you can teach kids this or something like that.
New message. Let's do number three. So, we'll get broadcast message here. Wait, no. We'll put the broadcast message there, because that's number three. And then we'll put that as number three. And number three is five times five. Five times five is twenty-five. Let's try it now. Two times two is four. Nine. Sixteen. Five times five is twenty-five. Okay. So we got a lot of it. Let's just say. So let's keep doing this. Broad cast message. New message. It'll be number four. This one be number four, and it'll be six times six. Six times six equals thirty-six. There we go. So let's keep trying because we want to make sure it's right. Four. Nine. Sixteen, twenty-five, thirty-six. Oh, I might actually add the numbers up a little, maybe to forty, because forty. 40. Hopefully this isn't too much. Just make it a little bit quicker and then we will see if it's right. So, okay, 2 times 2 is 4. That's a bit better. 9. 4 times 4 is 16. 5 times 5 is 25, 6 times 6 is 36, okay, so let's do 50 each, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50. there we go. So let's try one more time. And then maybe 2 times 2 is 4. 9. 16. 25. 36. Okay, I'll just move it here. So now, we'll make a new one for this guy. So, if you know what the if statements are, this will be a bit easy for you. When, if, sensing, touching, now this is crystal, so crystal. Okay, so we're going to make a new, I'm going to paint a new one, a new backdrop, and this one will be completely black, and it will be like that, and it will say, it will have green, green words, let's get that in here. 
win. Okay. There we go. So let's try the code again. Let's go back to code here. Switch backdrop to backdrop two. Alright, now what we want is we want when this clicked switch backdrop to underwater two. So now if I just quickly do it three times three is nine. Four times four is sixteen. Twenty-five. Thirty-six. Hmm. So it didn't change. Why not? When this clicked. Oh, see, I forgot something. You want the forever, so it keeps running until it happens. So. Now if I click this, and quickly do it again. Nine. Sixteen. Twenty-five. Nope. Twenty-five. Thirty-six. There we go. Okay. I won't leave this episode here, we'll probably just quickly do the loser part, where like if you get it wrong, so let's see how I, hmm. and it's a 16, hmm. well, let me just think, so, if it's a, Maybe it's this one. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Sorry, guys. I'll leave this episode for here today. And I'll quickly think about how to change it for this one. But I will definitely be back. Okay. Link in the description for Scratch. Yep. Have a nice day, guys. And there will be an episode soon. Bye.